Okay, we are standing outside of the DR Horton model home. This home is part of the Cadence community. It's 300 or 3,765 square feet. It is a multi-gen home. The price on this is 639,000. When we go inside, you'll see that there's a lot of features. As we come in through the front door, we have a nice foyer area to the right of the stairs. And there's this office or den at the front of the home. The electricity and the smart features that you see do come standard. The thing with the DR Horton homes is everything comes as is. The floor finishes, carpeting, things like that is all standard. There are obviously decorator touches here too, but it's something that you could add on your own later. Over here, nice dining area, living area. To the left will be the kitchen. We'll see that here in just a minute. In the hall, as we walk through, that would be the door to go into the garage space, which is right now the sales office. The door on the right is a nice coat closet area and extra storage underneath the stairs. So you can see it goes in pretty deep and around the corner too, if you need to have extra storage space. Go ahead and take a look at the kitchen next. Have a nice big island here. All the appliances that you see do come with. And this is where the first suite will start. We do have the downstairs bathroom. Over here, we have another closet for storage. Could be pantry shelves. This is a family area separate from the other spaces. They have it set up for a little mini kitchen with a fridge. There is no stove in the next gen suite. However, you can have a microwave and you can see how they have it set up with the toaster and coffee maker as well. Little dinette set. Seating area where you could watch television, read books has an exterior door so they can have their own private entrance and exit if they want. Going over here, nice bathroom area. It has the shower set up with a bench seat. Nice marble top. and then the bedroom area and closet. They have it set up with the faux TV. So as you're sitting in bed, you can watch television. So this is the downstairs bedroom suite for the next gen model home. We'll go ahead and go back upstairs. Again, this is the main kitchen downstairs area. In this particular model, the backyard appears to be large enough that if you wanted to add a pool of your own, you can. They also have a nice patio with lights. But again, this particular model with the lot could accommodate a small pool. All right, we'll go ahead and go upstairs and see the upstairs area. At this point, none of the DR Horton next gen homes have everything on the one floor. They have it split between downstairs and upstairs. But one of the things that's nice about this particular model is once you get up to the top, there is an extra loft area that you can use for an extra TV sitting area, lounging room. And then to the right 
We've got the additional bedrooms and laundry facilities. Here is the master suite or primary bedroom, which is a nice good size suite. To the right is the tub and shower and dual sinks. They mentioned that the color accent walls, again, would not be standard in the homes. So obviously you can do that on your own after. It would all be one color. Coming in, we have the master closet, which is huge. Nice big space here. And then at the end of the bathroom area, you do have a linen closet space. And then also, of course, the bathroom or toilet room. Go ahead and take another look at the other bedrooms. So we have the one downstairs, we've got the primary bedroom here, and then we have the loft, laundry room, good sized laundry room. It does have the plumbing for a sink, should you wanna put a sink in, in addition to the washer and dryer. Nice big space, you could put more cupboards in if you needed extra storage. Have a hall bathroom up here. Dual sinks, tub, and toilet room. This is a third bedroom. Just a regular size closet here. Going into the fourth bedroom. Again, standard size bedroom, standard closet. And we have a fifth bedroom down here. And this one has a little bit of more of a walking closet. And then as we go out this fifth bedroom to the right, we do have another linen closet space as well. The ceiling height seems taller than eight foot, so it looks like it might be nine foot up here, which is, gives it a very open feel. As we come back down here again to the loft area. Primary bedroom suite. And then back down to the stairs. So this is the smaller of the two next-gen homes that DR Horton has out here in Cadence. We'll go ahead and get the next one.